Alright, like this crossbow is like super old, super tiny. And I just wanted to see if it could cock back. And then I cocked it back and then I was like, the mom's like, you can't dry fire that. And then I was like, no. So then I just popped an arrow in there. This is an arrow for a compound longbow or a reeker. Uh, not a bolt, but you know what? I'm just trying to get this thing unloaded. So we're going to see if this thing can shoot. If it does, hopefully it doesn't explode. All right, here we go. Just aim this right to the target and... Ooh. Okay, maybe there's a safety off. Here we go. So we got a safety over here. Okay. Here we go, right into the bullseye. Let's aim it. Aim. Steady. Steady aim and... No way. No way. It worked. That's, that's in the bullseye, like, let's go. Alright. Crossbow shooting with compound arrows. That's what we're talking about. Don't get in front of there. Anyway, that's pretty fun. Alright, we're out with the PSE Stinger again. Uh, shooting compound. We just dropped a couple arrows in it. 50 yards, shot one broadhead, because I'm just trying to see how my broadheads fly, and I dropped four field points, um, as you can see there's a little bit of distance, it's a lot for me, but anyway, I haven't seen my shot yet, so we're going to go up and see how that turned out, uh, the field points I was aiming for top right, and the broadhead I was aiming center, so let's go check this out, all right, this is what the shot turned out. I'm leaning to the bottom heavily. Left and right's not too bad for the field points. Uh, my broadheads have been shooting right. I'm not quite sure how to fix that yet. Because I don't know if I like how much. Because as I go further out, it goes for the, to the right. So at 20, it's almost nothing. 30 you get more, 40 more, 50 you can see what it's at. And I was actually putting it up somewhere in this area. So it leaned a good, you know, maybe close to 8 inches. 7, 8 inches out. Um, I did not range this. Uh, anytime recently. So I may have been wrong. It, I'll range it sometime. See what my 50 is actually doing. My 50 was shooting low a little bit ago. Uh, I think two times ago that I shot, I was shooting on this target. I was aiming center and I had a row right across about here. Um, yeah, so I do like these groups. I mean, not quite touching. Then you got them touching. Uh, broadhead, obviously, I can't tell because I don't want to ruin too many of my broadheads is going. At 50 yards, uh, my broadhead is coming through this, I'd say, close to 18 inch, maybe a little bit over a foot foam target. So, I like the shot. As far as grouping, we got this much here, so like 6 inches between side to side. Oh yeah, I made a mistake. The one that was right there was a field point. Kind of sad. <laughs> because, yeah, I should have noticed that when I looked on the backside target, but um, obviously I'm not seeing things I right. was saying he was shooting with Jack, and Jack just got in trouble. <laughs> yeah. All right, so... Okay, that's a sad group now. Okay, this group just really changed. Um, this one I think was up in here maybe. Right about there. And so now we have 
It's not the worst. It's not the worst. That's kind of weird though. Yeah. I mean, I should have that. I just took off my broad head. The broad head just got in here. But he said the broad head in here. But um, he just just got the broad head in for a long time with Jack. And Jack just got in trouble. Um. Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> um, okay. So, that okay, is so. really kind of disappointing. I took my broad head off, expecting to pull so, this out as my broad head arrow, not even thinking, and then... Pull. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, well... Well, well, I'm not going to... So now you can really see. This is yeah. how much you my broad head is dropping see. going to the left. Yeah. It's pretty bad. It's too low. My yeah. group? I, I'd still say that's my a pretty good group at 50, especially for me. I think this is only my second the year day. intensely shooting with a high-pounded bow. First year shooting at 50. Uh, yo, that's a bit, quite a bit the ways off. Camera's not even good enough to see that far. Must be calculator problems. Come on, come on, poke one out for the door. Yeah, that was a really soft black squirrel. Yeah, but they're too far away. Yeah. See that one's up in the tree? Yeah. I'm like, oh, there he goes, there he goes. Come on, come on, come on. What is he going for, man? He is like running like a wild yeah. animal. Wait, are you, I have an opening. Are you up, in, up in the tree? I can see his head. He's right there. Thank you. No, he's, he's climbing up. 